10 Rarest Funko Pops in the World Funko Pops are vinyl figures capable of awakening our most nostalgic and fanatical side by recreating the most beloved characters of comics and series. Although they're made per thousand worldwide, there are some that are extremely rare and really hard to find. Are you ready to meet them? Dumbo Clown One of these rare Funko Pops comes from one of the classic Disney movies from 1941. This is the adorable and famous elephant with big ears who's called Dumbo, referring to the word dumb. This isn't a regular edition since it was a special variation of the Dumbo Clown, which comes with a painted face. There were only 48 made, and all were sold in 2013 during a Comic-Con in San Diego, one of the biggest and most important events when it comes to comics since it gathers thousands of fans in the same place. If you love this classic, you'll obviously want to have this one in your collection. However, this jewel isn't that accessible. Anyone who really wants to buy it will have to pay around $4,210. Although it's presumed that this cost will still raise with the years. Holographic Darth Maul who would have thought that the evil, agile, and smart character from the Star Wars movie would become a Funko Pop? Without a doubt, the evil also sells. The life of this character was based on revenge, so this pop will never be unnoticed. This toy isn't just holographic, but it glows in the dark. It appeared in 2012 at the San Diego Comic-Con. This beauty from the dark side costs around $2,336, which is a really high but not impossible price for a real fan. Actually, they are very difficult to find in their original box, but if you can find one of these, it can cost up to $2,500. Green Lantern Do you like shiny objects? Are you a DC Comics fan? Do you love Green Lantern? Don't go anywhere because this Funko Pop was made for you. This edition of Green Lantern glows in the dark and was sold at San Diego Comic-Con in 2003, costing around $2,190. With this Funko Pop, you've got nothing to lose since it's an aesthetic and attractive piece. Just to compare this piece, the metallic version costs around $270. Since it had a high price, only 240 of these were made and sold instantly. Skeletor Black Hood If you were an 80s kid, you must feel nostalgic when you think about He-Man, where Skeletor was the evil wizard that lost his face fighting against King Randor in Eternia, He-Man's father. He has just a skull as a face, and became a powerful lich that seeks for power and hides the secrets of the Grey Skull Castle. Finding a Skeletor or He-Man in Funko Pops is very rare since they're not that famous these days. Normally, these characters would cost around $130 each, but the version from the 2013 San Diego Comic-Con is the one the real fans are looking for. There are only 480 Skeletors launched to the market with a cost of $850 each. If you thought about buying this Funko Pop, make sure you don't mistake this with the 2017 Master Universe version. Don't forget this reminder. Metallic Genie from Aladdin Every time we watch the Aladdin movies, we wish that one of these genies would appear in our lamp and grant us three wishes. That's why the creators of the Funko Pops thought about selling this amazing character from a classic Disney movie. The deceased actor Robin Williams voiced this genie. Champ, what do you think? I think the man has to float. He has to be able to come in there and go against the magic. A fact that makes its price go higher and also makes it irresistible for collectors. What makes this Funko so special is its metallic structure, which makes it look even more glamorous than the original version. It sold out in the shelves of the San Diego Comic-Con of 2013. If you want to buy this Funko, you'll have to pay around $800. Will you spend this money for three wishes? Boba Fett Most of the Star Wars fans like to collect stuff about this incredible saga which are extremely expensive since they have a huge sentimental value for them. The Funko Pop community of Star Wars wouldn't be an exception. 
That's why this character from the famous saga, Boba Fett the Bounty Hunter, enters this universe. It was created by the cloners of Kamino and looked a lot like the clones of the Grand Army of the Republic. What's cool about this Funko is that it isn't wearing the same armor that it had in the movie, which was an exclusive edition which only had 480 pieces. This droid with a particular aspect that makes everybody feel the urge to buy it even if it costs more than $500. Although some people said that these prices mean nothing compared to what this could cost with time, since it's a really wanted object for any collector of this saga. Ned Stark Headless We remember the death of the beloved quiet wolf Ned Stark by the hands of King Joffrey. This character had an unbreakable sense of honor and justice, but his character was silent and a bit distant. To remember this sad fact, what's better than a headless pop? What's true is that it didn't only make the fans go wild since there were only 1,008 of these made. Despite this toy having a lot of details, it can be found on eBay at the price of $130. But the addition from the 2013 Comic-Con in San Diego is worth about $1,350. Bloody Rorschach This pop was based on a comic that was released around 86 and 87. He's a fictional anti-hero that was part of the series of Alan Moore and Dave Gibbons. It's based on the character from Charlton Comics, and its creator said that it was designed like Batman, who seeks for revenge in the real world. This toy has everything necessary. The mask, which was inspired by the stains of a Rorschach test, the gloves, and the hat, a similar design it had in the movies. What makes it special is its mask and the blood stain. Since it was a Comic-Con exclusive released in 2013, it's hard to find and has a price of between $400 and $500. Metallic Sign Stan Lee Did you think Pops were only based on fictional characters? The creator of the comics that have caused a great impact in the world is also a Funko Pop and has a special gold version. It cost about $149 on eBay and now costs around $60,000, a price that any fan would be willing to pay. This pop was designed by Stan Lee himself at the LA Comic Con, which was previously known as Kamikaze Expo, in 2017. That's why it has a high price. If you want to buy this Funko Pop, you have to make sure it's original. This one has a certificate signed by Stan Lee. Lotso Flocked I bet you remember this pink, cute, and soft bear from the movie Toy Story 3. I'm sure that now you don't get tricked by appearances, since this bear ended up being the villain of the movie. It seemed to be so cute on the outside, but it had a monster emerging inside it who tried to control every single toy. This is one of the most valuable and coveted editions since it isn't a regular version. It's completely fluffy and replaces the plastic parts. If you're thinking about buying a new one, you should start saving now because it costs around $140 and has even been sold at a price of $1,168. It's extremely hard to find online. Good luck with that. What did you think about this list? Don't forget to tell us which one of these you would like to get. Give us a like, subscribe, and activate notifications. See you next time.